What's good, y'all? It's I am King Mike back at it again with another video, man. And as y'all seen in the title and thumbnail, I'm about to bring you guys how to do post hop shot one cheese consistently. Because like I've got many requests on like like a video on how to do it. Cause in my streams, in my some of my videos, you guys see that I be doing it a lot. So I was like, might as well just bring a tutorial because I see a lot of people struggling and I see people in my comments wondering. So I like just better off. So the beginning of the video, I'm gonna be like explaining it and then after I'm gonna like have a gameplay of me just only doing post hop, hop shot one sheet the whole game like against an opponent so you can just see. But first off though, the first thing I wanna say, you have to listen to this closely. If you're right handed, you can only do it going to the right side if you're left-handed you can only do it going to the left side so like I, I, I'm gonna show like right there right there you see how like I don't know if you notice but the animation I get is different because on this player I am right-handed so when I go to the left it doesn't put me inside like it makes me like like a, I don't know how to explain it but you can you're, you can you can look for yourself like you're looking at my player if you do a hop shot to the like the side of your non-dominant hand you're gonna get a weird like a weird animation like right there I just messed up but the right side like that's my dominant hand so like that's like the first thing like the first thing you should always know never do it you see you see that like deep animation never never ever do it to the to the side of your non-dominant hand or you will mess up like always do it to your most so if you're left-handed remember you can only do it to the left side if you're right-handed you can only do it to the right side and so remember to do the move you have to like okay i'm about to speak from my perspective of someone that's right-handed okay so everything i'm saying right now is from my perspective so basically all you have to do is hold l2 and ho have your left analog facing the right side of the basket so your left analog should be straight right but with a little angle towards like the basket like you really you just want to have an angle of where you want to hop like where you want to hop shot you want to have an angle of where you want to hop shot oh yeah and also though remember post hop shot one like you should <laughs> this is my title so you should really you, i shouldn't really have to say it because it's post hop shot one cheese but as i was saying though and so okay now if i'm left-handed i know some of y'all make left-handed players because i don't know why i make i don't know a lot of people that are right-handed in real life make left-handed players in the game I guess they think they shoot better, but they really don't. The reason I always go my hand in real life just because I think like I'm, I don't know how to say it, but like <laughs> if you're right-handed in real life, you're gonna kind of play 2K like you're right-handed in the game, and so I don't want to be left-handed in the game and then play like a right-handed if that makes any sense. And so I really do hope me saying like explaining how to like put your left analog. If you need more like explanations. I hope this gameplay helps or just if you really really don't get it even from the gameplay I'm about to show you guys then just just comment down below and I'll try my best to like explain it word for word Cause I'm not gonna lie I never knew how to, how to do this move until this year last year I, I used to get dominated by this move but now like now I know how to do it so it's like fair game when I play on the ones court but it's not it's not hard but it's not easy at the same time but once you learn how to do it, like it's gonna feel like a piece of cake. And just remember, don't do it to the opposite side of your hand. Uh, but now I'm about to show you guys. Before I get into the video, bro, I always want to show y'all this clip for a reason, bro. As y'all see, he has takeover. He's a post score. He's not trash. So, cause then in the footage I'm about to show you guys, like the gameplay I'm about to show you guys, I'm playing a 98 overall small forward. Okay. So I don't want you guys thinking, oh, you can only do it to guards, blah, blah, blah. Like, you can't, you can do it to anybody. Like, as you see right here, he's 7-3 with takeover. Like, it works with any, like, it works against any opponent, bro. I promise you it does. I promise. But as y'all see, though, we're playing against a 98 playmaking slasher, slashing playmaker. This game, bro, this is an interesting game. If it was, I promise you, I would have destroyed him, but I specifically only did post hop shot one cheeses for the video like i really could have destroyed the kid but if it wasn't like i had to make this video just to, like 
to help people that are struggling out. That's the only reason the game was close. I don't want to spoil it too much, but at least that's, that's the only reason this game was close. Like in the beginning, I was kind of I was trying to leave him open. Like I was trying to because he's a slashing playmaker. He shouldn't be making these shots. But I just left him open one more time. I was like, if he makes it, then I'm gonna play up on him. But he missed it, so it was time to go to work, bro. And y'all gonna see post hop shot one cheese, bro. All I'm doing, that's the only way I'm scoring this game, is by a post hop shot one cheese. And so you're gonna see that I'm always constantly moving my right analog so I can switch my ball hand. Like, plus, if you don't want to get the chair pulled on you, it's the it's the best option to like to move. And right there, bro, that's that up and under cheese that I like. That's you can pull that out of the um. A lot of people jump. A lot of people jump when man. A lot of people jump out of that move. So you can really. I couldn't really show you in the my court too good just because I'm not playing as an opponent. So I'm gonna look pretty dumb if I'm constantly. <laughs> If I'm constantly just pump faking after hitting the move. So like you see you see why I'm doing that? Like the little thing with my right analog. I do that specifically so he can't pull the chair. Because now I don't know, the pulling the chair is a lot it's pretty it's pretty cheesy this year. Like it's pretty good against stopping. I pers I personally I do it sometimes whenever someone's constantly backing me down and it works pretty well. So if I want a video on pulling the chair, I got y'all. But right there though, y'all don't want to see what happened. Like I lost the ball, cause <laughs> I lost the ball, so I just cut that out, bro. I, yeah, it's kind of embarrassing on how I lost the ball, so I ain't gonna show that, cause that's embarrassing. But right here though, when I t and also, bro, this dude is a spammer. The thing about the once court, I've lost two games so far on a 10 plus game win streak. By the way, I lost two games. Where I was dogging guard like 18-0 or 20-0. But he kept reaching on me. And kept getting steals. And my grade would go all the way down. And I would get an F. And I would get graded out the game. Like it was crazy bro. But as y'all see though. Like I'm, I'm cooking this man. And I really don't want to. Like please don't say I can only do it to guards. I can't. Like I really. I literally just showed y'all footage of me doing it centers. And if you watch my streams. You will know. Like. I do it to centers, man. Like, even if you watch my videos, like, <laughs> if you watch my 99 videos, or when I'm dropping off these bad glitch 99s, you will see I do it to, like, anybody. And I know, and also, please don't say, like, why don't you just body him? Because I'm I'm literally only doing post hop shot one cheese for this video purpose. Like, I know I had an easy layup, easy dunk, but nah. It's for the video, man. So, I was trying to get every post hop one cheese I could. Because... Like, and plus, I, I, I'll get in the ball back. I'm not gonna lie, when I'm watching this dude play, this dude was greening every three. I'm surprised he's not greening now, but I'm glad he's not, because, hey, look at him, jumping in my face, it's still green. Like, hey, post hop shot one, he might be the move. It's, I just hate when people shove glitch, though. That's one thing about, sh if y'all also want a video on how to stop the shove glitch, I got y'all. Because, last year, I made a video on how to do it, and that look, he blew up. But, this year, I might make a video on how to stop it if people, like, just recommend it. And right there, I try. Oh, yeah. Also, you, you're going to see what happens when I do the wrong way. So, look, look. Look at this. Look at Oh, yeah. I was trying to do it. I end up, I do end up doing it. But I was trying to do it. And y'all see I was failing. But I'm going to end up doing it. Cause I wanted to get takeover because I want to make the fade. But you see that animation, bro? If you do, like, against a big, you're going to miss that because they're going to be in your face. And when you do it to the other, like, when you do it on your opposite hand, it stops you. It, you can't get the animation. Like, right there, I'm for up and under. I got so lucky. I'm so lucky. Like, I perfectly, I perfectly, like, was in, in the position. Because any other time, if I had tried to pump fake that and it went up and under, it would have gave me a jump shot. So, yeah, right here, I, I don't know. I don't know why I shot that. <laughs> I don't know why I shot that three, bro. I don't know why I shot that three. I don't know why I shot that three. Like I would cut it out, but I'm like, nah, y'all can see that. The other thing early in the video, y'all can't see that. That's, that's really embarrassing. But that, I don't know why I shot that three. Plus, I lagged when I shot it. But that's still no excuse. And yeah, this player, bro, hey, video coming soon. This player is a good demon, bro. I'll be, oh, I'll be, oh, I'll be shooting that rock, bro. No cap. But right here, though, this is when stuff started to go downhill, okay? Like, this is when stuff starts to go downhill. And y'all like, what? Yeah, y'all gonna see. This man! 
is an AI player because he fouled out the game because he wanted to be trash. So first, they, they make me miss that shot that was a like full white, okay? Now, this AI goes on a just, I don't know, this man, this man just went, I don't know what to say, but this man just went crazy, guy. Like, look at that. He misses it, but he just gets his board and just keep getting his board. And what, go, and what like, the AI this year is on steroids. Because when did they just start doing that pump fake, bro? They never just spam pump fakes. They never did that. So now the score is 16 to 18, bro. 16 to 18, and the guard, a guard AI hits me with a Euro. A guard AI hits me with a Euro step. And then he makes that. Like, and then he makes that. So in my mind, bro, I'm like, bro, Mike, you gotta lock in. You gotta lock in. And then he shoots that fade. And he misses, bro. I'm like, nah, bro. Nah, bro. But in my head, I'm like, bro, I'm trying to do a video for post hop shot one cheese. So I hit him with it. And then the guard blocks me, bro. So I'm like, nah, I'm sorry, y'all. I had I had to drop step him. Because I was not having it, bro. Because if I had lost this game, if I had lost this game, this video would have been like. It wouldn't. It would not feel the same, bro. It would not have felt the same. Like I already got lucky that when he blocked it, he didn't get it, cause I probably would have lost the ball. And oh my god, bro. But I do hope this video helped, man. Like I really did hope it helps. If y'all need any help, like any more help, just comment, bro. And I'll help y'all the best to my ability by replying to y'all. And I am a 95 now. I did go on a streak on this court and hit 95 finally. So roast 99 begins and i'll see you on the next video man and i'm out peace